Without objection, the gentleman is recognized. Madam Speaker, last year on August 1, 2007, at 6.05 p.m., Interstate I-35 bridge in Minneapolis, Minnesota collapsed into the Mississippi River. Thirteen people lost their lives, injuring nearly 100 people. The 13 victims were mothers, fathers, and children. Last year, on August 1st, this day, we as a nation were united in our grief for the victims. Today, the new I-35 bridge stands almost complete over the Mississippi River. I've had a chance to tour it, and it's a good-looking bridge. But we can never forget about the victims and the lessons that we've learned from the collapse. We will be having a memorial today in Minneapolis for the victims, and we will be celebrating the fact that we've come back and been a resilient community after this collapse. But I believe the tragic bridge collapse serves as a national call to action for our political leaders to focus on improving our domestic infrastructure. The time is now, Mr. Madam Speaker. I yield back. Expired. For what purposes?